This is the old walled garden, just below Overborland, near to Dunlop Hill, just outside Dunlop then. Now the local legend is that this used to be at one time the gardens for the monks from Kilwinning Abbey. The monks had a hospice here. And we know there definitely was a, mo a hospice at Monk Redden, just outside, just outside Kilwinning. Nearby here, the old original Borland House, otherwise known as Lake Borland, stood. Sadly, it was demolished due to its, its uh, poor condition. Here's the rather fine entrance to the walled garden. Ordnance survey maps show this as being cultivated and laid out with beds and paths. One of the possibilities is that we know that there was a castle on the hill. It seemed to have also had masonry. There are various stories of, of stone being noticed still there before it was removed. But we also know that the proprietor of the land here, who was probably one of the Borland's farms here, removed all the foundations and all the remaining stone from the top of the hill. And it may be that this wall garden was constructed from the stone from the castle. It's certainly very unusual for a walled garden like this to be associated basically just with your, your normal farms. Although it could be that there was a sort of bonnet laird here whereby the Borland house next to us, although some of the maps show it as Lake Borland, are like effectively a small laird's house possibly. And this walled garden suited the status of the owner. survey map show a pond being here. There's certainly a, s a small stream and it runs in a cundy, a drain right beneath the walled garden. There may have been a door over the corner here. Certainly the other side you can clearly see what appears to be the gate piers of a door also visible just here as well. This is the back wall of the walled garden here. Sadly, a great deal of uh, damage was done when some of the coping stones on top of the wall were removed. Here in the wall appears to have been what was an entrance. This is an old lane running down to a ford across the Glazet, which apparently was locally known as the Sandyford. So this is the old road which continued across the ford, up past what's known as North Borland. And there would jo join the high road on the way to the likes of Bar Mill. Just above us here is what was called at one time Borland Hill, where the castle was. It's more commonly known as Dunlop Hill. Beautiful surroundings here. Over Borland still survives as a farm. North Borland is now a private house. And this Lake Borland has been demolished, as, as previously said. This farm had a separate entrance, so it had its own lane that ran up where that gate is and bypassed over Borland. Acott Castle is quite close to here. It's an area rich in history. <laughs>